Hey, how you doing? Maybe no one has asked you that out of all of today. And uh, if not, I'm gonna ask you. How you doing? I hope you're doing alright and I hope you've been productive. However, maybe you haven't been so good. You haven't been productive. And that's why you clicked on this video. You want to stop being lazy. You want to know why you have no motivation. The one thing that's stealing your motivation. And that is TikTok. My name is Wada and I help other young men like me take back control of their lives. Also, this is Jesus. They aren't going to hear that. <laughs> Hello. That's Jesus. This is someone I have a huge of respect for. Someone who's... Quit weed. Cool. Am I cool to say that? Yeah. So someone who's quit quit weed, who's on self-improvement, and is focusing on a lot of the good positive habits in life. The thing is, how does TikTok, how does TikTok actually steal your motivation? And it's not just TikTok, it's a lot of things. It's TikTok, video games, instant gratification, social medias, porn. All of this is stealing your motivation. And how it's doing this is that TikTok gives you a small dose of dopamine, of motivation. When you initially go on it, you find that funny reel and you want to look for the next. It gives you that small dosage of motivation. However, after, it then lowers your baseline of motivation lower than it was before. So after, you'll feel worse. To put this into mathematical terms, say your baseline of your motivation and your dopamine is 70, right? Then you go on TikTok and then after TikTok, it goes up to 80. Right? You get a nice little bonus, but then after that, after you've gone off that little burst of dopamine from TikTok, your baseline will then go down to 50 to 40, which is way lower than it was before, which is, was 70. The thing is, this is the same effect that has been built, the same as the drug cocaine. You get a short burst of a high, but then after you feel worse, with it, and then you feel worse without it, so you need to go back to it. This is how TikTok has trapped you in this constant doom scrolling and getting addicted to social media. By making you feel worse afterwards, so you go back to it to get back to that little burst of dopamine, of motivation. However, discipline is super, super important. Most people, when they hear motivation, the first thing that comes to their mind is discipline as well. That discipline is more important than motivation, and it is. Discipline is incredibly, incredibly, incredibly important. It's a skill that can be built, whereas motivation is not. And discipline is super important, especially during times where you have no motivation, where you have to use discipline to get over and do the thing that you want to do. But that doesn't mean that we should shit on motivation. Obviously, motivation is something that we all want. Yes, having discipline to do the things that you are good for you, the good habits, is great, but wanting to do that, wanting to eat healthy, wanting to go to the gym is also really nice. It's really good to feel like that, that you enjoy it, that you want to do it more. However, this cycle, that instant gratification, TikTok, social media, porn, what it does to us by giving us this short dopamine and then lowering our baseline of motivation, it has literally fried our motivation. It has fried our, our baseline of motivation to the point where we don't have any. So that even doing simple tasks, simple, simple, tiny tasks throughout your day become a huge struggle. You have no motivation for it and you actually have to use discipline. The thing is, do you have TikTok? Nope. No. There are things that you can have which you can get over that sort of addiction, that need to go onto social media. It's like having Instagram, but forcing yourself not to go onto it which is really, really good in building your discipline. But there are some things such as TikTok, which is built in a way to addict you, like drugs, like cocaine. That stuff is just better out of your life, just to not have it. You may not even realize it. That's the problem. You may not even realize how bad this is for you, how much motivation it is stealing from you. Anyway, if you like this video and this video helped you out, please click on the one in the corner because this will most likely help you out and change your life as well. Stay consistent and do the best you can. Love you, bro. Yeah. <laughs> you want to give the camera a self-improvement kiss? Self-improvement kiss. <laughs> 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 All right. I don't remember what the fuck I'm supposed to say now. <laughs> <laughs> hey, you have a go. I was, I was like, for, for like 30 seconds, I was like, I was like this, and I was like, my neck was really uncomfortable, so I was like this for like 30 seconds, trying to like, <laughs> get some good air. Yeah. And my neck started to hurt. Yeah. <laughs>